it's, it's pretty interesting. You know, Muda's last event was January the 22nd, and I was involved in booking Sting over there. It was Darby Allen was AEW, and we had to jump through a bunch of hoops because um, I also helped out on Nakamura-san from WWE, wanted to wrestle Muda before he retired. Mm -hmm. So uh, I had to make sure that, you know, we weren't going to offend anybody or, you know, ruffle anybody's feather with all those different companies, you know. Um, so, yeah, it, it, it took se seven months to put that deal together, actually. Wow. And that was certainly a, a huge, huge success. How how were you able to uh, uh, traverse all of those company lines to get to, to, to make that happen? Now, you can't do this on a Google Translate because that's just, it translates what they're saying you know you and and if i can best best describe myself as i'm an interpreter you know what i mean mm -hmm. i'm gonna tell them what you're really saying mm -hmm. you know so so uh, like i always say i'm an interpreter and not a translator you know anybody mm -hmm. can translate you know um so that's that's it and 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 like i said you you can't just you know you can't just call them up and say hey i want to book you know, I want to book Sting for my show in Japan. You know, you'll never get past the front door. And that's mm -hmm. that's what happened was that Noah went through the front door and got a couple of no's. And, and Noah called me, because I know Takeda-san, the president of Noah, called me and says, hey, you, you're a friend with Steve, right, Borden? I said, yeah. He lives in Texas with me. And I said, um, uh, I'm currently in Iowa, but, you know, I have a home in, in, in Texas. So I said, you know, there, the Muda is asking for Sting on his last match. So you know, can you can you let him know that if if that's within the realm of possibility? When I called Steve, he didn't know anything about it. Hmm. So like I said, he never got past the front door of AEW. So you know, so those are the things that 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 I and and because of that, and I negotiated the deal for Sting. And 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 uh, um, one of the thing was that w one of the most interesting thing, relationship trust. Uh, uh, Sting said to me, because 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 of the exchange rate, new, the Japanese company Noah wanted to pay him beforehand, like a month before. And I, I called I called Sting and I said, hey, they want to pay you, you know. He said, no no no, I don't want to get paid it after the first year for tax reasons or whatever, you know, I don't know. And I said, well, I think it's a good idea to get paid. You know, it's, when somebody want to pay you, take the money, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, that's how we think. Mm -hmm. And 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 uh, Sting says something very nice. You got to read between the lines. He says, no, I'm not worried about getting paid because this is Sonny Ono deal. So I don't have to worry about that.